See? And another one. I'm on a spot to test the Mifine Outrange. My, it's the 198 cm version throwing a soft plastic on a jig head and I pair it with a pteropos. Let's see if I can catch something. We are trying to catch fish that are coming up on the river from the sea. <coughs> Let's if I can catch anything. The technique I'm using is darting. I have a small dart head. I think it's 2 grams or 1.8 grams dart head. A very very small finesse one. And I have a spin polar soft jerk minnow with some flaking. Flaking in here is crucial because these fish usually are triggered by shiny stuff. But you can see that I will be quitting the darting soon. Snag. Quick swap for a tiny spoon. I'm using the one and a half gram. My friend was using the two and a half gram with a bit more success. But still after a couple of casts where I wet my braid, I could cast a little bit further. You can see the braid going out smoother after it's wet. This is the ending blast. Actually, very good braid. Ah. Miss Hook. One is in. Finally. Very nice fight on ultralight. <coughs> Do a flip. Yes, my friend is tossing another one because he caught about 50 fish this day. He can't keep getting away with it! But there's no resentment or anything like that. These fish are very very strong and in here I'm trying to quick release this guy. So he's going on his way. Very very strong. Swimming away. Nice. <coughs> so first on the channel. Sea shed. Actually, it's not the first one because I already posted a video with a pure little sedan on the water and in that one I caught a lot of sea shad. It was on the same day as this one, but I used first the outrange and I was having no problems hooking the fish. So I think for this type of fishing, the hollow <coughs> construction and the faster action with a hollow tip, it's better than the solid tip even if it's faster but that can also be related with the lure because the lure was different i was not casting this uh, one and a half gram lure on the um, pure lure sedan it was not rated for it okay. and another one that's different species so two on the board what a big nose And this is the end of the session. In here, we are trying to catch mullets by the mouth. I'm using the darting rig that I had on the beginning. My friend is still with a spoon. But at least I tried. First impressions on the rod are very, very good. I think I will use this rod for bass fishing and single hook applications. And yes, my friend caught a mullet. He will land it. And it's another one for his tally. But continuing on the Mifine Outrange, you'll be seeing more of this rod on the future because I'll be using it with the Darren Carbon when I will test it, the reel that looks very, very, very good on this rod because it's also red. 
and you'll see me using it for single hook applications. Yes, I caught something. A stick. But with that said, I'm very, very satisfied with the quality of construction out of the box of this rod. The action, it's very, very fast. It's the fastest me find a rod that I own. But until my next video, I will see you guys next time. Bye.